Kerry Savannah, all the way from Machinleth in Mid Wales, um, here with a triple harp and a, a lost voice. I'm afraid there will be no singing for you today. Um, I started there with an original composition called Er Ellen, which is named after a mountain in North Wales that looks over um, the house that my grandmother grew up in, and then an arrangement of a Welsh folk tune called a Pipith Coch, which means the Red Piper. Um, this type of harp is a very special and unusual type of harp. It has not one, not two, but three rows of strings. So the two outside rows are tuned like the white notes of a piano. And the middle row are tuned like the black notes. Which means that you have 
everything you could possibly need in front of you and you don't need levers or foot pedals to play in different keys. The, the obvious design flaw is that a third of those notes are in the middle, which makes them quite difficult to play. Um, so us Welsh triple harpists can be a bit cowardly about playing them. Um, but I wrote this next piece to try and force myself to use them a bit more because if I'm going to spend most of my life tuning them, I might as well play them occasionally too. So this is a piece called Krydra, which means um, wandering, like walking, not thinking.
Um, that was a piece called Bridos, which is based on a short little melody that I found in the uh, Welsh National Library's archive. And now I'm going to finish with uh, an original composition called Emina Glau, which means um, Hymn to the Rain.
Discover new music at listenerpoweredkexp.org.